Chance for Richmond as they come clear, playing it out wide towards the centre of the ground. Sutton leads just to the ball. Can he pick it up? He doesn't do so. And Tate going through very quickly for them now. We see uh, Jess. Jess with the ball almost directly in front. Good kick from Jess. Through for his second goal. It comes in the direction of Scrimshaw. Scrimshaw, his kick up towards the centre wing position. Plenty of players up with the ball, but none can bring it down. A chance for Richmond once more. And speed being shown, uh, they get the ball forward. Oh, muffed it up though, never mind. They've still got a chance through Jess, I think it was. Jess has a shot for goal and puts it through. Shut the gate. Direction of Hummel, it's going to be dangerous to South Melbourne. Hummel, plenty of time to steady down. Hump it in towards full forward, towards Jess. And Jess will bang it through. A long kick up to the full forward zone. Oh, Jess got a ball. Oh! doesn't take the ball but Reigns recovers very quickly gets the handball back to himself and Reigns with the long kick in towards the square at the back is Boyd Jess tries to break through dribbles it could be a goal to Jess over behind Bartlett is Reigns and Reigns goes for Cook to Jess Jess is teacher player there's Jess in it. comes Jess on his own will it bounce right he's right now he better do something about this. He's going to take a fortnight to kick this. He's fired for the goals now. It looks all right. So it's a beautiful goal. This is taking up, uh, has taken up a position. There's Jess coming into the pack now. Fly high. Got the hand to it. And Jess has taken the mark. Now gathers the ball well. Put a handball to Jess. Does so now. Jess turns around and puts it right to the A little Waitman desperately diving in after it. Comes out again. Tries to knock the ball on. He's still going. Waitman gets a handball over the top to Jess. And Einsadel from 60 metres out won't make the distance. It will be Jimmy Jess. Puts the handball forward to Mervyn Kane. And Kane has time to steady and drive a long kick up towards centre half forward. Quote that line. Jess is. to go through with Reigns. He copped the hefty one but still kept going. Out to Jess. Reigns in there again. Peter Moore seems to have copped one. Lou, did you see what happened? Once the result will have come around enough. Doesn't reach the distance. And there's a great mark taken there by Jess. Straight out to the wing to Turner. Turner playing on them with a long drop punt up towards Sam Newman again and Jess. Jess comes over the top. Arriving at the club as a full forward. He's booted it out the centre wing. Jess is there and has got the mark and it's a good mark. Bartlett or can the Geelong defence take it away? Right up towards the square. Jimmy Jess. Takes the ball away from that half-back line. Back it goes to Jess. Out the move of pick and hold. Back away. He's grabbed him around the neck. It'll be a 15-metre penalty. He's been a very good Richmond defender so far, and so has this guy, Jimmy Jess. Not that he's playing in defence at the moment, but that kick puts Richmond up towards their attacking zone. Bartlett's down there. Streams past the ball, actually. McCormack, well shepherded by Ireland, tries a short pass up towards the flank it is, and there's Jess again. Long kick by Smith down towards the half-forward line. Bartlett and Moore. Out it comes towards McCormack from Young. McCormack looking for a hand pass. It goes to Waitman. Back and turn the chest. Running into an open goal. Another one to the Tigers. Hawthorne putting the ball up toward Montreef in the pack. Jess was there too and a good mark for Jimmy Jess. Forward takes the mark. Glenn Dilling of Bill for a free kick. In comes Jess. He's got it. So on this occasion, but he still covers a fair amount of Oh, good mark. mark. Great mark by Jimmy Jess. Forward. Jess knocks it on, great play by Jess, can he kick a goal, centre half forward, he fires, the long drop punt, Malarkey goes back, a great goal. Rowling's heaved out of the pack, Jess takes the ball, right half forward, puts it high for Roach. Oh, look at this. It's a goal! What a goal! The name's kick is high, oh. Jess in front of Cox, great mark. The wing he goes, Jess, oh, what a the ghost does it again. There to Johnson, the ball up there towards centre half forward. There's Jimmy Jess flying over the top of the back. Wide to right half forward. Jess good mark. Over the back of the pack it is. Here's a chance, a beautiful hand pass. Comes to Jess. He fires at the goals and he has kicked it. Now, if Jimmy Jess was practising kicking before the game and he was dropping them through from just short of this position, he's kicked one goal. That is one oh. of the most magnificent torpedo punch you will ever oh. see. Oh. Oh. That one. Jimmy Jess who will fly from behind. Jess again gets the handball across to Waitman. Straight through the middle. Great play, Jess. Dashing through his wall. Wall goes for the pass, looks for Jess. Jess takes the ball on his chest, plays on straight away. Outside, and the best players on the ground for both teams is that. There's Jimmy Jess. That's a good and mark. what a mark to Jimmy Jess. There's with a drop punt towards Jess. The drop punt on its way. Not going to make the distance, but I think the mark will have to be paid to Jimmy Jess. 
And it's now a chance for Collingwood up the goal squares, but Jimmy Jess, a great mark. Sit right down from the back pocket, puts a high kick down. Up high in the front position, we saw a Banks, but a nice mark over the top by Jimmy Jess. I don't know whether he's injured or not, has gone to full forward, which is a very strange move. Well, I think there might be some something in what you said banana about banana kick being the injured. banana kick what's he done with it jimmy jess he's pulled through to the center of the ground big pack will form jess over the top a great mark up towards jess he flies to me jess here towards right half forward he's looking for jess a good target to aim at and what a mark great mark to the ghost towards the center of the ground grotter where he stands his ground jess takes the mark and a good one no he kicks it into ward royal royal opposed to jess and oh! a great mark taken by jimmy jess well, Perovic's passed it to Jess, his immediate opposition. The ghost will steady. Shoot. And goal. Great play, Jimmy. Got a hand pass to Jimmy Jess. And this is danger for Collingwood because he has a long shot for goal. It's pretty good. It's a goal. Yes. He wins the thumb. Puts it wide. Cowie completely lost it. Picked up by Jess. Jess puts a long goal in. It's football. It's a lovely goal, Jimmy Jess. Former Collingwood player, back to Strawn. Strawn to centre wing. Jess, leading out well from Phillips and takes the mark. Oh, he's got right underneath that one, landing it round about centre field. Good mark to Jess, taking it in front of Phillips. Doing a good job down there too. Stewart's kick out to Jess. He played only, I think it was a quarter in the South Australia Victoria game on Tuesday night at Football Park, so he should be fairly fresh. Jess. He can thump the ball a long way. One of the best kicks in the competition. Up to Taylor, yes, that's a mark. And near, close to the boundary line, almost went over it. In fact, he's flattened after he kicked the ball. Just on the goal still puts it through anyway. All clear, says the umpire. Mark missed by the skipper again, Rowling's not having a great day at present. Early days yet. Jess to right half forward flank. And Punches the ball on, it goes out there towards Allen. He can't pick it up. It's picked up by Jess, who lifted his game in the second quarter. It's a big one, and the ball will bounce back to Jimmy Jess. Gets around his opponent pretty easy. Goes for a pass, looking for Taylor. Near goes for a pass right across to Jimmy Jess, and he doesn't let him down. He takes a beautiful mark at centre field. Jess quickly plays on, looking out there for Taylor. Rioli, look at that for play. And is this fellow a magical player? As he goes for a pass. And Jess has got an inner collected a near then, but he grabbed the mark. And with the kick by Jess, looking for Taylor again in the front pos, he's got it! What a job he's done on Dacos, put him out of business all day. Hand pass back to Jimmy Jess. Jess is looking for Taylor to make a lead, and Taylor's coming out now, but this is Egan at the back. That's his 23rd, this is his 23rd kick, Peter. A near towards right half forward, he's looking for Jess, a good target to aim at, and what a mark! Great mark to the ghost. Eight marks to Jimmy Jess and 19 kicks. So those stats would just about make him best on the ground. Job today, mining uh, at the back is Jess, and that's one of Jimmy Jess's best. Lights down, is this the quick reply? Floats a drop punt, and a great defensive mark taken by Jimmy. Wilson, hooks it back, Harris, lost it, Jess, goal. Hart ran into a bit of ball there, Thompson ran into double trouble. Really had nowhere to go, and the Tigers put a, a big tackle on him. It's, it's, uh, this is starting to look like election day 1974. Because <laughs> it's put them in pain, three kicks for holding the ball. Well, and, and Roger and uh, Jim... Uh, not happy with each other. Rod Cardle to bring the ball back into the play. Just over 27 minutes gone. A lovely mark to Jimmy Jess. Now that was an excellent mark. Uncertain which way to go. He's got James this side of the ground and he elects to go wide. Jimmy Jess up high and another good mark to Jess.